Welcome back to another video here at Ori's YouTube channel. My name is Roberto George and I hope you are having a great day. And today with a solution that will allow us to connect not only two or even three but four different displays to a single display just using this adapter USB Type-C to four HDMIs. This is another split extend solution from Ori which will allow us to extend our laptop screen to four displays simultaneously. This is the SX4C4K10 80. There will be a link down below, but it is a compact and powerful USB to HDMI split extend with four HDMI outputs to connect to four extended displays on a Windows system or on a Mac OS system. But that being said, let's go and take a closer look to see how simple and easy it is to set it up and use it. So this solution is the Ore SX4C 4K1080 and inside the package we will find a user guide, a power adapter to USB type A and a USB type A to USB type C cable and of course the split extend device which it is all built of aluminium really well built and also some ABS plastic. Now it comes with a built-in cable and this is a USB type a cable but it has a built-in adapter so we can plug into a USB Type-C computer. On one side we will find the DC 5 volt input so that we can connect the USB Type-C cable that we just saw and then we have four HDMI outputs. Now if we take a look here we will have one 4K at 30 Hz, one 1080 at 60 Hz, another 4K at 30 and 1080 at 60. So a total of two outputs at maximum of 4K at 30 Hz and two maximum outputs at 1080 60 hertz now it's really easy to use but let's check it out this split extend requires silicon motion drivers to work so all we need to do is to go to the silicon motion downloads website download the drivers for our device if it's windows then we just need to download to windows and install it in a matter of two minutes or so if we are on a mac then we just need to download on mac and there we go if we are on a work computer for example then we might need permission and we just need to ask permission from our administrator to install those drivers. Now to use it is just as simple as connecting the USB Type-C cable to our laptop and then connect one HDMI cable to each of the displays, connect the power adapter and that is it. We will be able to use the four displays individually plus the internal displays. If we get duplicated screens at the beginning we just need to select on the options extend display and we will get this result right over here. We have a Windows 11 computer plugged in with four external displays. We can go up to 4K at 30 Hz in two of them and 1080 at 60 Hz on the other two. So if we are doing a photo editing or video editing then probably we will want to use the 4K at 30 and if we are just using a Word document or Excel then probably we will select the 1080 at 60 Hz. Now just a really quick example, if I wanted to have this workflow I can have for example Microsoft Word or any other app and then I still have here Microsoft Excel for example where I can just do my work here without closing anything and then just move to PowerPoint and then probably copying some data from here to here or vice versa browsing the web at the same time and besides browsing the web any other app on the uh, monitor of our laptop. Now just remembering that we can use up to two split extend units and get up to eight displays which is a crazy setup but this will depend on the laptop that we have. And now using the MacBook Pro with the M1 Pro and Mac OS I've got a finder window here on my laptop screen but I can just use all of the screens as I wish. Now I do have a small setup with a Word document also a Excel document right over here which we can work without closing any windows that is the goal of this kind of setup. We can go full screen or we can go just windowed. Also a browser which is something that we usually use on this setup so that we can copy or we can read and then write on the other and then here on the last left display we have also a PowerPoint document so that we can edit if we want but we can use any app 
basically and if I want to change the order I just need to select which screen I want to use. Now just to mention that unlike Windows that can support up to eight displays here on Mac OS we will be able to use six displays. So we can use two units, split extend and a maximum of six displays plus the display of the laptop. So at this moment we have five displays and we can go up to seven counting with the max screen. So at this moment we have five displays, four external, one internal, and we can go to six externals and one internal, making a maximum of seven. And that is it. As we could see, it's really easy to use this split extend, which will turn our single laptop into a workstation with one built-in screen, plus four external displays. It is really compact and small, as we can see right over here, and it will help us to, in a really easy way, extend our workspace. And if you've enjoyed the video, don't forget that usual thumbs up right over there, which is really appreciated on this side of the screen. And if you still haven't subscribed to the channel, please consider doing it so, so that we can share on reviews and tutorials such as this one, and really cool gadgets, such as the Split Extend family that you will be able to find on the Aureus official website that I will leave down below. That being said, my name is Roberto George, and as always, I'll see you on the next one.